There's only one thing you think of when you think of Hooters. Wings. Ba 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 ba. Hi, I'm Notorious DOD. Welcome to All You Can Eat Wings at Hooters. And right, here we are at Hooters All You Can Eat Wings and French Fries. And who do I have with with me? If you recognize him, maybe I don't know. He's got the beard now. James Watson, the battery killer. Uh, he's done some videos with me before. We're gonna go in there and see how many wings we can eat. I think we figured out the break even is uh, about 16 wings. If you can eat 16 wings, you're making money on them tonight. Yep, easily, definitely. So that's the goal then? Yeah. All right, we gotta go over 16, that's the goal. Let's head inside and get started. You can see on the menu here, the normal price for 10 wings alone is $16.49. And we're only going to have to pay $19.83 tonight for all you can eat wings and french fries. And the french fries do look good. Now I'm going to try every wing option they have in the menu. And James is going to try to keep up. Regardless, we're going to have a ton of fun. Let's go. Here I am with the battery killer. Going all you can eat wings. It's actually all you can eat wings and fries here. They give you a big bowl of fries. These look good, but I think because they're cheaper than the wings, they, they really hook you up. Good. This is a really good deal. I started with hot sauce, it is good. And nowhere near hot. This might be mild at best. You have three different types of wings that are included with a special. Uh, boneless wings are not included, so I did not order any of those. But the original breaded wings, you have naked wings, which of course don't have the breading. And then you have what's called Daytona wings, which are the naked wings with Daytona sauce, and then they throw them on top of a grill and kind of sear them a little bit. So those are the three styles. They have tons of different types of sauces. So I'm going to try to get one of everything. Can I the garlic habanero? Of course. I ordered my first refill on wings. I don't eat them that often. Let's see if I can still clean wings like I used to be able to. Wow, that first wing came out pretty clean. Let me try it again. Uh, unfortunately, this time, I think it would have been just as clean, but unfortunately, the one bone broke, and I had to get that out of my mouth. Thank you. I really prefer sauced wings versus dry rub, but I'm trying everything tonight just for you guys. So here is the dry rub. I'm going to eat it early on and save my favorites for later. Apparently, you tend to start at 6 these wings were really hot right out of the fryer, but I was pleasantly surprised how good they tasted. I think I've been missing out avoiding these dry rub wings for all these years. Good. Can I make it with the hottest hot sauce you have? Uh, we have a free mine. Okay? Yes, we have. Okay. Okay, yeah. I tried to order the hottest wing sauce they had, and Avery recommended Three Mile. I got a chuckle because I know what Three Mile Island was. It was a nuclear power plant that almost did a full meltdown back when I was in junior, junior high school. But I know Avery's not old enough to know that reference. She's probably wondering, why do they call it Three Mile? Service is quick. This is their second hottest sauce, Three Mile Island. This is not hot. See? Not hot at all. These wings had a lot of flavor. I enjoyed this sauce, but it definitely wasn't hot. It was what I expected it to be. You know, a little bit of spice to it, but almost never at a restaurant do you get actually spicy, spicy wings. Favorite one so far? Definitely the hot wings, but you're not hot, like you said. Um, but Daytona, we, we, it's a really close second. Like, okay. Those, they're, they're not hot at all. Like, the first ones are zero hot. These are less hot than that. They're just good flavor. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh -oh. I'm starting to fall out. But again, I've had two drinks. Oh, no. I've eaten with James before, and once he gets that look on his face, he's about done eating, but he's eaten a ton of wings tonight. We didn't get a count for him, but he's well above his 16. 
that's a good sauce. It's, it's definitely heading towards barbecue, but it's not near a sweetie barbecue. I'm not sure if they threw these wings on the grill or not. That's what it says in the description of the menu, but I don't see any like black marks from a grill, but they still tasted good. Thank you. 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 Thank Spicy garlic, which is the only one that's five out of five on the spice charts. Let's go. No. It actually kind of looks like yours, though. See? I wonder they mixed them up, but this isn't spicy. It is not hot or heated. Yeah. I'm gonna say this. This is a hot. Oh, it is hot. It's definitely hot. This I wanted spicy garlic. Well, I also wanted the breaded. Breaded hot. I think these are the these are breaded hot. Okay. And uh, these I thought were spicy garlic, but it doesn't taste that hot. Really? Yeah. Are they spicy garlic? Do you want to get some more? You know, I'll eat whatever you want to have. Yeah. The naked, uh, well, spicy garlic. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we were giving somebody else's wings. I wonder what. I was like, my taste, that makes total sense. My taste buds are going. Right. I don't know if you followed what just happened. I don't even understand. I was there and I edited this video, but somehow we were given multiple plates of another table's wings accidentally and then our wings came out and now i got totally flustered i have no idea what wing i'm eating now and probably for the rest of the video i know i ate all the wings on the menu and more but to be honest with you i lost count how many plates we've gotten now i can't tell you how happy i am right now this is the best they smell different. I can smell them different. I can smell the garlic. This is the original one, the hot. This was one of our bonus plates. This is the breaded wing with hot sauce. It was my first order I had the night, and it's probably one of my favorites. So I'm kind of glad I got extra of this. The original, so many calories, are so good. I know, I know. I have sweat pouring down the side of my head, and yet I'm claiming the wings aren't too spicy. But for me, I have a reaction. As soon as I think I'm going to eat something spicy, I start to sweat. And yet none of these wings are that spicy. But of course, I have the hottest one coming up next. Naked wings, rather. Gotcha. This is supposed to be the hottest one. This is spicy garlic. Okay, this is the hottest. It definitely tastes the garlic. The other one was not this because there's no garlic there. Like this is this is like very eatable place. There's no there's heat, but it's not like a go I made a mistake. These are like these are take forever. It's definitely not hotter than female hot. As hot as it must be as hot. I don't know that this was the hottest sauce they have. I think it was tied with the three mile sauce. But then again, you're listening to a person who's got sweat running off his head, claiming nothing is hot. James, of course I'll eat your extra wings. Are you kidding me? You can see these wings are definitely grilled. This plate is the Daytona wings, and it's a great option. One of my favorites I had for the night. And in the lower corner, I put in footage of an old contest. This was a national wing eating contest. You had to win a qualifier somewhere in the United States. Now I'm from Pennsylvania. I flew to Texas. I won that qualifier. Then I qualified to go to the finals in Florida and it was filmed at the original Hooters location. So this is the national championship of chicken wings. 
First of all, I never just a couple of games. <laughs> nice. I uh, I never planned to have. At this point, I'm thinking I could do this all night. This is naked three mile island. This is supposed to be second hot. That was the I think it was all you can eat wings and french fries with James the battery killer. Uh, James is tapping out, so I'm gonna tap out now as well. Uh, I don't want to keep him here all night. But thanks for coming out with me, James. Always a pleasure. Thanks for having me. And I hear he's going to be having a channel come out soon, but when he does, I'll make sure you guys find out about it. Thanks for coming to another video, and I'll see you guys again soon. So I want to thank Ari for a great night, fantastic service. If you come to the Hooters in King of Prussia, check out Ari, A-R-Y. Thank you so much.